हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम बैक टू साइबर्टिक्स नाउ वी नो अबाउट वॉट इज ब्लाइंड एक्सरसाइज एंड इवन आई हैव गिवन टिप्स एंड टेक्निक्स टू फाइंड ब्लाइंड एक्सरसाइज वेलरबिटी इजीली इफ यू हैवेंट वॉच इट प्लीज चेक इट आउट यू कैन क्लिक ऑन द आई बटन सो इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू सी हाउ वी कैन ऑटोमेट ब्लाइंड एक्सरसाइज इजीली एंड दैट टू इन अ डिफरेंट मैथड सो विदाउट वेस्टिंग एनी टाइम लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड So let's start with our blind exercises automations. In the previous video, I have explained what is blind exercises is about and how we have to enter our blind exercise payloads on the post base request. That is about the contact us forms, submit feedback forms, and many other things. But we are coming to the different techniques of the blind exercises. That is about now we have we can add our own header on the request headers with our blind exercise payloads. What will happen? Let's take an example. What if we add a blind access payload on the X forwarded host header or the referral header? So when the request has been sent to the server, we there is a chance to get a ping back from that thing. It might be a request like post based or the get based. It doesn't matter because we are going to automate it with the tools and techniques. So first of all, you have to navigate to our one liner GitHub collections. So Also in the previous Twitter post, I have shared the one-liner bug bounty tips and tricks over here. You can see there are many more bug bounty tips and tricks with our one-liner collections. Also, you can just try it out or whatever the feels you good when you try it for the bug bounty hunting. So today we are just going to focus about the blind accesses in X forwarded for header. So let's just see the installation requirements. we can see we have to install a b access tool which is written in the go lang so as i have already installed in my system so you can just check it out because it's a easy process for that already we have a go that is a get all url and the find domain instead of find domain you can use other tools like sub finders or the domain finders too so simply i just copy the one liner so let me just explain you the one liner how the working is being so you can modify that uh, payloads as well as the headers too so find domain hyphen t it means that we are adding the target it means that it will just grab all the sub domains of it so our target was del.com so let me just add and we are using a go that is the get all urls so for each and every sub domains we are getting the all the urls of that domain so it's a very huge process and another after that we are using a b access tool where we are adding a payload that is our this particular payload has been got from the b access center you just need to uh, create your account and copy and paste your payload over here and we are adding a header tag where we are saying that in each and every request of the, our target just put this particular header in the request part and just send it out no matters what it is the request is about whether it's a get based or post based just send it out you can also change from x forwarded for to referral header too just the thing about is go, go little one by one so let me just copy this one liner so let me just paste it out and hit enter so as you can see the tool has started and we get an options it not just covering for the get post it is also looking for the post based too also the put also you can see how it is being working so first of all it has found some random domain over here and it is adding a x forwarded for header and using my payload that is about the blank access payloads in each and every part so let's just wait for a second there is a possibility of the false positive vulnerability because we can't guarantee about the automation part but the chances about the finding the blind access is become easier because it is looking for each and every urls of that sub domains too and once uh, we don't need to continue watch or monitor this particular automation the reason is because whenever our blind access payloads is getting hit you will get a message or the mail from the b access hunter that okay this particular page has been Uh, reflected with our blind access payload so you can just report it and get a good bounties so i hope 
you understand the different techniques to find blind access vulnerability if you face any issue while running the one liner please reach out to us via our telegram community channel i'll share you the link of our community channel in description so you can access it i'll see you in the next topic till that time goodbye and jai hind